school security continues to be the hot topic of conversation at Sarasota County School Board meetings. There is progress being made when it comes to the discussion regarding school resource officers. ABC 7's Rick Adams has more tonight from the Sarasota County School District headquarters with some of the highlights on tonight's meeting. Rick? Yeah, Jacqueline, there was a lot talked about at today's school board meeting regarding school resource officers. Many more details continue to evolve. There's much focus from the Sarasota County School Board to continue to make schools safer. The school district says in the coming days they will be making offers to 21 new school resource officers and three sergeants. A chief was just announced last week. These resource officers will be for the county's elementary schools for the coming year. They will be in addition to the officers already in place at the county's middle and high schools. It's an important conversation and everyone is, is really just focused. In addition to the officers, yes. other elements of school safety were discussed and approved, including vehicles for the SROs, adding an additional $400,000 to the safety security systems, and the salary structure for officers, which will have a range from $34,000 to $37,000 a year. Having the money, having the, say, the salary schedules approved, having the approval to move forward with the purchases, all of those, kind of every single piece along the way is important. Local law enforcement will be supporting the school district and the resource officers. They sat down with the school district last week to try and work things out. A rocky relationship now between Superintendent Todd Bowden and Sarasota County Sheriff Tom Knight has kept them from finalizing plans regarding the school resource officers. Because of that, Eric Robinson was one of the board members who voted against adding more vehicles to the fleet and against the salary structure for the officers. The meeting on Tuesday, told us that that we there's a lot of unintended consequences and a lot of things that we hadn't thought through. We, we are good at educating students and law enforcement's good at keeping us safe and we should each do what we do best. And the Sarasota County School Board is inviting the sheriff to a special meeting on June 28th to hopefully iron out some differences. Reporting from Sarasota, I'm Rick Adams, ABC 7, your Suncoast News. Okay, Rick, thank you.